Okay. This is what the land looks like when it's not maintained. All of that is Japanese honeysuckle, Asian privet. Let's see, uh, Asian bush honeysuckle. And Oriental Bittersweet and one other of impressive non-native vine. See there's a bush of bush honeysuckle and privet. So this is the wildness that happens when you don't do anything. Somebody said, oh yeah, let nature take care of itself. No. This is what happens when you don't do anything. Look at that. I mean that is just fiercely ugly and destructive and it doesn't get better if you don't do anything about it on the other hand if you look on this side while it's not great it's not perfect we have started to clean out the non-native invasives the asian privet and bush honeysuckle and vine honeysuckle See, we've got rid of a lot of invasive vines. Okay, I don't know about you, but would you choose this, or would you choose this? Now, nobody says it's going to be easy, but if you value value your environment and the beautiful birds of the USA and the beautiful trees that we have, you would just do a little work and get rid of some invasive, non-native, privet, bush honeysuckle, vine honeysuckle, or your bittersweet, and such. Boston ivy is one of them. Sorry people, I know you love your Boston ivy, but the truth is it will kill your trees and it will take your roof off. It doesn't belong here, it belongs in England. We, want, we have a beautiful ecological system, a beautiful environment, and people are planting the wrong stuff in their yards. Get away from the Asian pears and the maple, the Norway maples, and the non-natives, all the exotics that are invasive, and start planting the natives. We have beautiful trees here. Is it gonna be formal like it is in England? No. But going to be better for your environment and better for the ecological system and you will see more birds and you'll see a better wildlife habitat you will breathe better these trees are are necessary for life if you don't have the trees you're gonna die they give us oxygen we give them carbon dioxide so we've been working on these lots and getting rid of the non-native invasives I even worked on this a little bit, but when you go over here, this is where we're going to start working this summer. And I just want to show you, because somebody said, you let nature take care of itself? No. If you let nature take care of itself, this is what you get. You got to get in there and do the work. Please, people. For a better environment, for better wildlife, for better habitat. Do it for yourself, do it for your neighbors, do it for us all. Thank you.